Hey everyone, I'm Scott from HostGator, and in this episode of Hosted, we'll cover five of the easiest ways to make your website more secure. Yeah! In 1995, two of the greatest movies of all time came out that not only introduced me to my all-time top two celebrity crushes, Angelina Jolie and Sandra Bullock, but also introduced the world to how cool the hacker life is. I may not be able to introduce you to my future wives, but I can introduce you to five easy ways to make your site more secure. Number one, install security plugins. If you're like me and mask your insecurities by pretending to be a comedian, Nope, let's take that again. If you used a content management system to build your website, then you have a whole bunch of options for free and paid plugins that you can install. They are specifically designed to prevent many of the most common methods hackers use to gain access to your site. For WordPress, you have plugins like iTheme Security or Bulletproof Security. In Magento, you have Amnesty or a Watchlog Pro. And with Joomla, you have JHackGuard and John Defender, Jay Leno, Jay Z. <laughs> Shoot the J. Should I keep going? J.K. Simmons. J.K. Simmons. With these easy to spell and pronounce plugins, you can set up security measures like changing the URL of where you log in to your admin page, limit the number of failed attempts at logging in, and so much more. Additionally, if you use a CMS or straight up HTML site, you can utilize SiteLock. SiteLock provides additional daily monitoring for everything from malware detection to vulnerability identification, an investment well worth it. And SiteLock is actually built into our managed WordPress hosting plan. Boom! That's what I call security, baby! Hey! Oh. Yeah. Ah. Number two, use HTTPS. I have been told that I put the S in HTTPS. <laughs> it's because I value security, okay? And I look good doing it. Ah, <laughs> yeah, there it is. Uh, mm, yeah. Uh, Ooh, uh, yeah, bring uh, it back. The difference between HTTP and HTTPS is very important. The addition of the S means that you have installed an SSL certificate, which basically encrypts the data sent to and from the server. Up until Google released a 2018 Chrome update, SSL certificates were really only needed if you were transmitting customer data like credit card info. But now, Chrome alerts visitors if a certificate is installed or not, no matter what making it more likely they will leave your site. If you don't have one, lame! <laughs> Get yourself an SSL certificate and start living that encrypted HTTPS life, baby! You'll even get a blinged out lock icon next to your URL. Ooh, girl, looking fresh with that lock icon. There are different levels of SSL certificates that offer different levels of security at different levels of cost. But lucky for you, all HostGator hosting packages come with a free SSL certificate. Ooh, oh, what a deal, again. Shoot you with the deals, baby, yeah, yeah, yeah. The certificate will automatically be applied to your account when you sign up, but there will be a few steps you need to take to finalize the install. Number three, update your site regularly. Think of your website as a parent who doesn't like it when you go too long without calling. If they don't get updated, they're more likely to have a breakdown and write embarrassing stuff on your Facebook wall, leaving your personal info out there for the world to see. Yes, mom, I still have my retainer. Oh. Notice I didn't say wear my retainer. <laughs> so it's not a perfect analogy, but if you don't update your website, you could be more susceptible to security issues and hackers. If you're using WordPress, you can accomplish this on your dashboard page under updates. If there's a little number on a red circle, smash that update button. Mm. Number four, use secure passwords. Do not use password as your password. Apparently, 123456 is still the most common password. Don't know how that statistic is verifiable as passwords are supposed to be secret, but then again, maybe that's why we're in this mess to begin with. Like as if hackers are putting out this like uh, fake survey. Question one. This is how hackers talk. What's, what's your password? <laughs> to make a good password, make it long, use a mix of special characters, numbers, and letters, and don't use easy to guess keywords like kids' names, birthdays, or the word password. Ugh. Also make sure anybody else who needs access to your site uses these standards too. The best way to create a password is to use HostGator's password generator to create a random string of characters. If you can't remember it, save it to your browser keychain or use a third-party password manager like 1Password. Don't keep it on a post-it note on your desk. Nana, I'm looking at you. <laughs> Number five, invest in automatic backup. Automatic backup, great feature for a website, not a great feature for a car. Oh. Had a car in high school with automatic backup. So many busted garage doors. Uh. <laughs> 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 Having regular backups of your site is a great failsafe for security. If your site does happen to get hacked, then at least you have a pre-hacked version that can be reinstalled. Once restored, you can make sure your security measures are all in place, 
your plugins and CMS are updated, and maybe now for once you'll consider updating your password, you idiot. You can also manually back up your site or set up an automatic workflow through any of the available free or paid plugins. Or CodeGuard, our add-on service for shared plans that can even email you a zip file of your backup at a predetermined interval. Neat! Woo. And there you have it, five easy ways to improve your website security so Angelina can't get in there and steal your identity. In our next episode, top five Sandra Bullock movies, which is impossible because they're all number one. What's your favorite security measure? Tell us in the comments. What's your favorite Sandy Bullock movie? Tell us that in the comments. Whatever you do, do not write your password in the comments. Keep that to yourself. Yeah. My password is... My pa that's my password, Miss Congeniality. Yeah. M-I-S-S-C-O-N-Congeniality. All right, thanks for watching. Bye.